Court Hadlock Shannon Wolfson is on assignment. First here at 5 o'clock, a county court at law judge from Williamson County had to go before a judge himself today in Austin. Judge Tim Wright is charged with federal firearms crimes. He's accused of knowingly selling guns to a felon who was then taking them across the U.S. border. KXAN's Chris Sadegi was at the federal courthouse today when the judge turned himself in. Now on the other side of the bench, Judge Tim Wright decided to let his attorney do the talking. Judge Wright's innocent. He's ready to establish it. A federal indictment has already established charges the judge was illegally selling guns to a felon and knew those guns were going across the border. A raid at his Georgetown home last month seized 51 guns. They also charged that the judge told some lies when he bought guns last year. When you buy a gun from a dealer, there's a federal document confirming that you're buying it and you're buying it for yourself. The indictment says Judge Tim Wright bought guns here at Guns Plus, but they were for someone else. We do not believe he was illegally selling firearms. We don't believe he made false statements to federal agents. We don't believe he was trafficking weapons to Mexico. And that's why come Thursday, Judge Wright might be right back on the side of the law where he's usually sitting. The position right now is he's going to stay on the bench because he's innocent. Now, ultimately, the Judicial Conduct Commission will make some uh, adjustments or offer its input. A judgment upon a man trusted with making the right judgments of his own. From downtown Austin, Chris Sadegi, Cakes AN News. Wright's attorney said they will meet tomorrow with the Commission on Judicial Conduct to discuss if and how the judge will continue to hear cases. Our calls to the commission today were not returned. We checked, and Wright is a federal firearms license holder. It's the only way someone can legally sell guns. Not completing a background check violates the rules for a dealer. To give you some perspective, the ATF issues federal firearms licenses, which legally allows someone to broker and sell firearms. License holders have a list of rules and procedures to follow. That includes a background check and making sure they are not selling to a criminal. The FBI says people with felonies or even some misdemeanors are not eligible to buy them.